one battery. A week from now, I'll start turning mine on. A few minutes every day at dawn. You get up there, that's how you find me. One of the most challenging roles to cast was Rick. Yeah. Rick was, of course, the lead of the show, and in an interesting way, this pilot really just has a lot of Rick in it. Don't be afraid, okay? There's not a lot of dialogue in that first pilot episode, so you had to immediately connect with the character and whoever this was going to be. I'm sorry this happened to you. We knew he was the leader and going to be going through so much. <laughs> Casting Rick was definitely the obvious person to start with. And we did a lot of searching. We auditioned a lot of wonderful actors. Interestingly enough, John Bernthal came in and read for both Rick and Shane. You see the frame photos on the wall, huh? Well, neither do I. You think some, some random thief took those two? No, all of our photo albums, our family pictures, they're all gone. John Bernthal has a little bit more of a bad boy quality to him. And I think that that really worked well with Shane. We really put him through the ringer testing for two roles. And he ended up getting the role he was meant to get. What are the odds, huh? We didn't get Rick from that first initial test. And we went back to the drawing board. Anybody out there, anybody hears me, please respond. I was spending a late night going through my list of actors I love and I had kept for myself as a young assistant. And, oh, Andrew Lincoln. I, I really liked his work. Yeah, that's me. I mean, we'd all seen him in Love Actually, but, you know, I had seen a couple of other things he had done. They are like, oh my God, oh my God, brilliant. Is that right? Yeah, baby. Mm. The next morning, I reached out to his British agent and sent him all the material. And Andrew self-taped, and we all huddled around our computer, and we opened it up, and we watched it, and I just remember all of us just taking it in and being like, They're alive. My wife and son. At least they were when they left. Something clicked in his audition when he was talking to Morgan. It was Rick, and we could sense it. It was like, he had, he had the qualities we were really looking for. A real hero that could guide us through what was happening to the world and somebody that could then, we could see that good person changed. All I am anymore is a man looking for his wife and son. Anybody gets in the way of that's gonna lose.